hi to Chaco. Focus here, bottom right. He does go for the Blade Master Grunt this game. I don't think there's gonna be Farsh here, unless it's uh, Farsh here with Grunts, but uh, last time he played against Happy, he went uh, Farsh here twice. It was without the barracks. This game, it is a Blade Master. In fact, here for uh, Happy, he goes for a Death Knight, Crypt, Tomb of Relics. Early Death Knight, is he, uh, wait a second. There's a graveyard, okay. There's a graveyard. Acolyte, what's he doing here? He's gonna kill some rocks. These rocks are very easy to kill. They're very low hit points. Oh, he f <laughs> there's a crab. There, there's a hermit crab over there. I didn't even know, but the acolyte knew. Just kills it with his bare hands. I'm not sure how he does it. Like the hermit crab has such a, a tough shell. But somehow the Acolyte knows exactly where his weak, weak points are and he kills it in two hits. Hey, you are Rakuten. Welcome back. Let's bet how many creep focus will still steal before a second hero arrives. Mm. Mm. I'm, I'm just going to focus on the game for now. There's a ghoul. A but you guys can bet. Ghouls here, the death end here with the skeletons. He's going for the rogue wizard. We move over here, we have a blade master. Go for the renegade wizard. Wait, was that the rogue wizard? Is that what it is? Did I misread? Anyway, a ring of protection here for the blade master. Not very good. The death knight here, he doesn't get anything. Probably got a tome or something beautiful. Just this wizard over there. And now he's going for this renegade wizard. Meanwhile, the blade master going for this acolyte. He sees the acolyte scouting. This acolyte, is he dead? I mean, he had so much more to live for, but he's dead. And now the blade master is level two. Level two, Mazuru. We have a quick, 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 quick. Albatross over there. Burrow's going up. Blade master healing. Buys a speed scroll as well. Almost forgot the speed scroll. And uh, here we get a gloves of haste. Level two, death knight now as well. Beautiful creeping here at the start of the game. Woo -woo. There's a fiend. Blade master, only one grunt. Only is he going for wyvern again? No, wait. Burrow wasn't done yet. Never mind. That's a second grunt. <laughs> a player's force There's the grunt, guys. Don't don't panic. You see more grunts. The blade mass, death knight is creeping over here. Slippers of agility. Maybe it would be a great Christmas present here for focus. I'm not sure how close they are to each other, but you know, if he uh, if he wants to give a Christmas present to focus, this would be perfect. A worn slippers of agility. Uh, it kills the kills the hermit crab there as well, and some uh, actually skeleton is still, still on cooldown. Well, the blade master, what item did he get? Wait, what? He lost a grunt. What? He lost a grunt creeping this. Are you kidding me? Is this his plan? Is this the the strategy he had in mind? Losing his grunts to creep. These guys, of course, of course, they have a uh, stun. So your grunt might get stun locked in the in opportune time. This grunt. Hello, folks. Don't lose your second grunt. It gets stunned as well. Are you kidding me? Oh my god! He loses two grunts here. <laughs> <laughs> this stunning creep so annoying, so difficult to, uh, difficult to creep for uh, Orc. Blade Master here with the uh, Bandit of Energy going for more of these uh, Kobolds with stun. L is he going to lose his third grunt? I don't think it's possible. No, critical strike. Gauntlet there on the ground. Did the skeleton, did the skeleton see the bodies? I think he did. I think he saw the grunts, skeletons and he must have known that the uh, grunt Blade died there to the creeps. Maybe he saw two of them, two of the bodies. The skeleton sees two grunts over there. Uh, Beast Terror is going up. TC, what is this strategy? TC, is he going for an expansion? Or was that his plan before he lost two grunts to creeps? Uh, TC second, of course, not something we see anymore. This is very unstandard. Not standard at all. He's not, go he's not attacking. He's just staying tier two. I wonder if he's going for a spirit lodge at some point or if he's uh well we'll see we'll see that night here slaughterhouse going up 
Skeleton sees the DC. Happy knows it's a DC. He knows there's no tech. He knows it's going to be easy game. Um, what was that? A player's forces are under attack. I heard something. I didn't see anything. Did someone use a dust or? Not sure. Maybe happy used the dust. This here is about to be born. The Death Knight. Oh, look at this beautiful shell here on the on the ground. The Death Knight doesn't pay attention. Neither do the fiends, but I see it. I pay attention to that. This little detail. Oh, does he? Does he? Go over here. This grunt is slowed. Is that the third grunt that dies this game? Uh, yep. Ooh. Ah. And uh, he's dead. This Cobalt Taskmaster is also dead. Tome of Agility picked up here by the Death Knight. Is that all it gives? A Tome of Agility? The Death Knight, uh, Blade Master is doing just fine for now. Whose sentry word is this? Oh, Happy? Did he just place that or did he still have... Uh, did he have this here already? I'm not sure. I don't even know when he got the sentry words. He has another one uh, over there. It's actually a pretty uh, game-changing item. Oh, we have the expansion here for Focus. Chaco, nice job paying attention. Uh, he doesn't even have a Berserker Strength yet. Doesn't have Raiders yet with Ensnare. Uh, he has Ensnare upgraded here in a moment. This is going to be cancelled for sure. And then even then, Happy... Oh, Raider dies to creep. What the fuck is happening in this game? Hello, GG. First game was, was so horrible for Focus. I've never seen them play this badly. What do we have this game? We have this uh, beautiful map. Of course I know the name of this map, guys. Of course I know the name of this map. You know, you might ask me, hey, Chaco, do you know the name of this map? I know it's, uh, of course I know the name. It's uh, Templefield. It's Templefield. The name of this map is Templefield. Because there's a temple and we have a lot of fields. That's probably how uh, the name became Templefield. You know, these fields. What are the fields? I'm not sure. This is a temple, I think. Like, I'm not sure, actually. What What is the temple? Is this just one? Is this entire thing the temple? Are there farms or, you know, buildings, high elf buildings here um, inside the temple? Anyway, we do have a blade master and of course grunts. How many grunts is, are, is Focus going to lose against creeps, guys? This is something you guys can bet on in the chat. You think he's going to lose two grunts to creeps, maybe three. Actually, not just grunts. Raiders also count. Chaco, how tall are you? 182 centimeters. This is six foot. If you uh, measure in foot. But in Korea, you use centimeters. So that's uh, 182. Hmm. Great. Blade Master is about to be born. It, which Blade Master is it? It's a Daisho. I didn't check what Blade Master we had last game. But I, ho I hope for... Uh, Hope for focus is a different one because the last one he has to be fired. He he didn't take Players care of his grunts at all. Attack. He's going for the forest soul berserker, or is he? No, he's going for the forest soul set of priest. He changed his mind, and then he will go for the berserker. Of course, the acolyte he scouted over here. He didn't go for the turtle first, uh, like he like we see a lot of uh, blade masters do on this map. This gives sentry wards, by the way. Look, we see uh, the death knight going for it. Sentry ward or a uh, similar level item. I'm not sure if it gives lightning shield. I'm not sure if you can get it over there. The uh, Blade Master sells his TP. Got a gauntlet. It's a not useless. It is uh, pretty decent here against him dead. In a late game especially. These uh, skeletons here against a murloc. Uh, four skeletons against a murloc. The skeletons seem to win this fight. Beautiful. Acolytes scouting over there. Death Knight moves around. I mean he... He dodges the Blade Master. I'm not sure if that was on purpose or uh, by accident. But the Blade Master do, does find uh, Death Knight's creeping here. Will he use the dust? Oh, he doesn't even need to. The, he gets the XP. The Blade Master gets the item. I'm pretty sure he got the circlet. Uh, the Blade Master had to fight uh, attack there because his Windwalk was running out. So he couldn't go for the level four first tall high priest. Blade master, did he just buy his slippers? Pretty sure he just sold the gauntlet and bought slippers. Hundred gold, fifty gold loss, I guess, if you make the uh, yeah, add in the fifty gold that he gets for the uh, gauntlet, right? He sells the gauntlet for fifty, buys the slippers for one hundred. 
He's hunting down his acolyte. And meanwhile, the death knight, he's going for this item. I'm, I wonder if it's the same level item. It is. Claws of attack plus six. At least this time he gets the item and he's uh, had an XP as well. There's the first fiend. I mean, I think so far the start of the game has been going great for uh, Happy. He doesn't even want to use... Oh, he doesn't have coil. Okay, never mind. No coil. These guys with inner fire, they're so beautiful. That's something you see. Usually you don't see ogre warriors uh, together with a forest or a high priest. Usually they're with the ogre magi. So they're bloodlusted. So it's uh, interesting, of course, to see them with the inner fire. This grunt is running for his life. Fiend is doing a bit of damage. This, fiend, this grunt... Use a speed scroll. Where's the coil? Not there yet. He doesn't have the mana yet. And the grunt, he has more than 100 hit points anyway. So uh, it's going to be fine. The speed scroll was used. But... I mean, it was used to uh, save the grunt. But uh, he also tried to kill... Tried to use it, you know, for his other units to kill fiends or something. But he couldn't get... Oh, the coil was way too early. Nice uh, feint there by focus, of course. And that was his last coil for a while. But there's three fiends now. Three fiends against two grunts. There's one grunt at home. Uh, very low hit points. Uh, that's it. Uh, actually, the Death Knight got it, right? Blade Master didn't just level up. He leveled up with earlier, so... Oh, but this fiend... Can he save the fiend? Beautiful blockage is needed. Oh, there's a Windwalk. But that's his last Windwalk, so he can't... No, it's not the last Windwalk. But he was, I guess, just low on hit points. He was dusted. Uh, I figured it was mana that was his limitation, uh, limiting factor why he didn't go for the fiend, but it was in fact hit points and uh, I think he was dusted. Would have died. So if this was, uh, if this was fly, he probably would have killed the fiend and lost his blade master kappa. <laughs> but we were watching focus. There's a slaughterhouse. There's a ziggurat. Skeleton scouting. Oh, I forgot to check. A Shadow Hunter. We have a Shadow Hunter and we have attack. He's playing standard this game. He's not going for the tier 2 expansion with the TC. Getting radius with and snare. Skeleton here going for the Shadow Hunter. Arr, 94 critical strike. Kills the skeleton. First Observer does go down. Oh, is he? Where is he going? Let's see where he's going. Oh, by the way, Scourge Bone Chimes. Is that the item? Where did he even get this item? Is that the item he got over there? That's, uh... Yeah, that is the item he got over there. Rune Bracers. So, uh, Rune Bracers, not that great for the Death Knight. Just, uh, he sells it for 200 gold. Scourge Bone Chimes. It is it's not super duper strong in this matchup. It's still a strong item. I mean, but, you know, not as strong as the other matchups. Uh, because lo late game you go mostly ranged. And uh, the way Undead just focuses unit one by one. It is a uh, useful early game though. There's another raider. Wormill is going up. A player's DC. Are under attack. Blade Master killing some Ogre Warriors. Okay, so we have a level 2 Shadow Hunter, level 2 Blade Master. He's almost level 3. Here we have a level 2 Death Knight, level 1 Lich. Where, when is the orb timing? He's at Black Citadel. Does he have the orb already? Oh, he does have the orb. So there's a creep check here, but is this bad for Happy? Because he just got the orb and there's no orb yet for... Uh, for focus, so I'm not sure if it's even bad for Happy. Do, does he have many? Oh, he doesn't have mana for coils, and the coils would still be level one. So one fiend does go down, and uh, the raider gets away. His next fiend is going down as well, but he trades it for a grunt. Does he have mana for coils yet? Not yet. He will have to give the TP to the lich. Don't lose your lich. He TP's out the lich. So, uh, yeah, the Death Knight, he's, uh, he's not level 3 yet. He does have a statue now here to regenerate mana. Actually, two statues. And more fiends. Quar. Quar. Blade Master is level 3. By the way, I assume he has level 2 Windwalk. 
and I'm not sure. Because if he's just creeping here with the Blade Master, maybe that means he has uh, critical strike. There's a dome of strength there. No one picks it up. Under and we're all happy. He finally has his level 3 death and level 2 list. Finally, these heroes are super powerful and he gets a third hero. Happy is now ready for a fight, except that he's uh, six foot behind. Of course, in this uh, engagement that they had uh, over here, he lost a, two fiends and a TP. And he only killed one grunt. Ah! In this game, Focus didn't lose any uh, grunts or raiders to creeps, at least not yet. Maybe, maybe over here. No, nope. not yet. Okay, here comes Happy. He has uh, crap. The Blade Master picks up, what is it, parry up? Oh, this grunt, oh, yeah, he's dead, right? Is he dead? Yeah, he's gonna die super fast. There he is. Happy uh, transfer to destroyer. He has a destroyer now. Oh, man of health. <laughs> Seems Happy doesn't want to engage and neither does uh, Focus. So they both retreat. The Lich does plus attack. 20 damage. But he's pretty strong with the uh, Claws of Deck plus 9 and plus 6. Blade Master, he has some extra hit points. He has uh, plus 25 damage with the Kodo, that is. Do we see any Banshees? We don't. No Banshees. Do have the Dark Ranger, by the way? Nope. No, uh, what's he called? The other Lord. Pit Lord? No Pit Lord. DC is uh, still quite far away from level 3. He will be level 2 pretty soon. He might be able to creep into level 3 actually. Just solo creep the DC. This creep camp and this creep camp will probably be enough. This creep camp is so weird. Like a level 6 a Murloc and two level 4 turtles. Oh, he's not solo creeping. So, But maybe he can still get him to level 3. There's so many creeps in this map. Potion of Invul, that's nice. Uh, 15 second Invul. He has an Invul on Shadowhunter now. That's super nice. And one on DC as well. Info poison on every hero is perfect here for focus. That's, you know, he's not going to lose his heroes. And that means he's going to win. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, maybe. The player's forces are under attack. Now they're creeping the entire map. Ah. DC is level 2, Blade Master level, almost level 4. I, I actually, I haven't been paying attention at his crits, but I assume he, um, since we haven't seen his level 2 Windwalk uh, Ras, he probably took level 2 Critical attack. Strike. And is he going for this Red Creep Camp now? I think he is. I wonder if Happy can creep this one and the Red Creep Camp over here before Focus will hit his base. I don't think so. Blade Master doing plus 29 damage and he has a gloss of haze. He attacks very fast. What item did Happy get over here? Uh, mm. uh, not sh oh, the second health stone. He has two health stones now. There's a potion there on the Lich. Okay, Happy is actually going for this green creep camp. What do we get there over here? Claws of attack plus 12. Decent. Blade Master picks it up. He does plus 38 damage now. And he has his info potion, right? So this damage, he can do 15 seconds of free damage. Where he's not being nuked. Doesn't even need the healing waves. He's just 15 seconds of, of mass damage. He just needs his TC list level 3. Oh, actually, he's actually walking across the map to get this item here as well. He will have an expansion going up. Uh, Chaco, maybe he should have showed this expansion a bit earlier. But, uh, you know, I'll show it right now because we have the skeleton attacking it. Happy will uh, probably have a level 3 Dark Ranger as well before they fight now because, you know, they're not going to fight. I, I still wonder, like, did he have uh, speed score or anything? You know, he could have maybe forced a TP here. Oh, we do have Banshees now. Banshees are initiate. So, Curse on the Blade Master. Is, uh, is nice, but info potion, 15 seconds, no curves. 290 critical strike. Blade Master is so powerful. There's a healing wave. We have level 4 Blade Master, level 3 TC, level 3 Shadow Hunter, by the way. Blade Master now going for the dragon, picks up a tome of strength. 
He has uh, no more healing salves here. He has a replenishment potion, but it's happy. Happy will fight. Go here now, but he will realize it's trapped already. Uh, the dragon ate a raider. What do we get? Good of cunning. Ah, uh, it's not really not that nice. Not Our really. Forces are under attack. Not really a nice item. Imagine if Happy just showed up over here and just sees the blade master, just coils him or novas him, and he just dies. <laughs> that would have been cute, but uh, that would have happened if this was last game. But this is not last game. So we have four, three, three here for uh, Happy. Who's at 65 supply? Focus at 69. He has a four, four, three. So one uh, hero level advantage there, but the shadow hunter doesn't matter that much. The thing that does matter is that uh, Blade Master does a shit ton of damage and he's not going to die. Neither is a TC going to die. And neither is, you know, anything going to die, really. See, TC might die at some point because he will use the Info Potion to uh, counteract the Silence. And then later he won't have an Info Potion anymore. We also have three Wyvern, maybe uh, also something to note. Do we have Web? I don't even know. This tower is taking a lot of damage. There's no shop here, though. This is a mistake here, but focus. You should build a shop here. Hello. Where's his shop? There's a stomp, a uh, beautiful stomp, hit three fiends. This uh, wyvern here in the front take a lot of damage. The blade master is cursed, he's, uh, I mean, for now he's just fighting. The Kodo is gonna eat something, now he misses his dinner. The, the skeletons killing these unarmored, uh, medium armored units very fast. Uh, Lich here tries to kill Kodo. The Kodos are both empty, there goes a fiend somewhere. I thought I heard a fiend die, but maybe I'm wrong. Uh, no, it was a wyvern, maybe. This destroyer here in the air needs a coil. The Death Knight has your mana potion. Is uh, this wyvern dying here? Yes, he's dead. He's so dead. This code is still empty. Hello. Uh, there goes the wyvern. The blade master has to use the info potion. He got nuked and he had to use the info potion. Now he does a lot of damage. He's not cursed at the moment. Uh, so let's see this 15 seconds of pure damage. He only one crit so far. 210 damage. Where are the crits? Hello, blade master. Why are you... Shadowhunter is almost dead. And there's a crit. 237, finally. He only critted once. Uh, or twice, maybe, in this entire duration. When he was invulnerable. TC is super low. Oh, TC is dead. Shadowhunter uh, is, doesn't have info anymore. Neither does the Blade Master. Suddenly, Happy is uh, no longer afraid of these undead uh, orc heroes. Supply-wise, is still pretty uh, even, though. And the Blade Master is back. He's uh, two, uh, missed and a 240 critical strike. This uh, Wyvern is just uh, webbed and he's dying fast. He's banished his super long hit points. But that doesn't matter because every orc unit is just missing them. No, Blade Master hits them. And uh, the Kodo here, pretty long hit points as well. This Burrow is being really annoying. Uh, killing statues. Blade Master helps out a little bit. Kills the statue. Blade Master is windwalked, of course. And he's level 5 now. Level 3 crits. Let's see if level 3 crits can uh, pull focus. You know, into the driver's seat. I guess he sacrifices these peons. He doesn't. Uh, he doesn't have enough mana here on the shadow hunter to re-engage. But the TC is not back for some time. I guess he couldn't take that fight. And uh, I feel like one of the reasons, one of the reasons, Focus is losing this, is because he didn't build a shop. He didn't build a shop here. Uh, Dark Ranger, she's gonna buy some info potions. Or one. Oh, there's no info potions available. Blade Master or someone already bought it. Oh, Dark Ranger, trouble! Uh oh, she has a. No, no one even notices that she's there. Hello. Yeah, now she's no longer in trouble. Frost armor, coils, everything there to save him. Her. I mean, the Death Knight has full mana. This Kodo is gonna be killed. Why, the, why even try to eat? Okay, no one focuses the Kodo. But still, why even try? Like, the Kodo should have just been saved in the background. He almost dies. Okay, well, uh, don't kill the Kodo, you know. Don't kill the Kodo. Oh, the Kodo's dead. And so many skeletons here. The Berserkers don't stand a chance. The Blade Master, he needs more crits and not misses. A critical miss. He's, this Banshee is just not dying, finally. Come on, Blade Master, not miss. You need crits. Where are the crits? He goes Windwalk. Focus goes Windwalk. The Lich is super powerful. We still have uh, one heal stone here for Happy. He still has a DP. Player's forces are under He's attack. nine supply up. This level five blade master isn't enough. Plus 27 damage without the code. The shadow hunter is so low on hit points. He's uh, healing. But uh, the death knight has a coil with the name shadow hunter on it. 
One more uh, coil and the Shadow Hunter is going to die. The statue tries to kill it. Statue doesn't do enough damage. There's a healing wave, of course. Statue does go down. Uh, Fos Nova on the Berserkers. And one of them will go down for sure. The other one is coiled. Oh, another uh, few happy units that die there for free. Two fiends, and, I mean two banshees and a fiend. So happy just lost four units uh, for uh, two Berserkers. It's a good trade. Those were good trades for focus. And look at the supply difference. Focus is back in uh, almost equal supply. A master is taking a lot of damage to the heal wave, but that is okay. There's more heal waves. There's a coil on the radar, and he TPs out. This fiend. Oh, fiend gets eaten by the Kodo. And are there creeps left on this map? There's a green creep over there and over here. I wonder. Uh, I think both of them have the item already taken, so just two little trolls. We have the uh, same here, just two ogres, I think. Or one ogre, maybe even. There's nothing there. Not sure what uh, he's doing here. Blade Master is level 5. The Shadow Hunter is level 4. four almost level 5. And TC is level, almost level 4. If he noticed this creep camp is still alive, he should creep it. Player I think it's uh, enough for the solo top. creeping there with Shadow Hunter to get level 5. Uh, it's more important than TC level 4. That's not uh, that important. Here we have a level 5 Death Knight, level 4 Lich, level 4 Dark Ranger, Blade Master being annoying. Happy at 50 supply, focus at 39. But uh, Happy has a fiend there in the stomach of the Kodo. Or, yeah. So he's actually only at 47 supply. We have uh, 200 gold only left in these gold mines. Wait, and 50 only here. I didn't realize this game took so long already. That's been going on for so long already. There's that pocket expansion. FP. Gonna get shades though. There's bunny in the base. Look, he cut away all these trees. He has super easy access to the mercenary. But this tree line is super uh, thick. But this one is actually is probably also pretty uh, as thick. The ghouls just chopped away a lot of trees. Looks a bit thinner. Nice hunt summons. Here comes the shade. He's gonna scout the expansion. And we'll see another attack there. Happy is 18 supply up. Should be pretty easy for Happy. Should be pretty easy. Blade Master, let's be careful. There's a shade here. He does have an info potion, but he doesn't just want to use it. Maldazar, Lord Maldazar, the Death Knights, level 5. A lot of beautiful unsummons. Guess he will buy some more items underway. Maybe info potions, maybe. Uh, maybe. Heal school, maybe? Maybe TP. We never really see heal scrolls in this matchup. Guys, a scroll of protection. Okay. And? Well, the info potion is not available. Scroll of healing. Okay. 60 supply against 47. The blade match takes some damage before the fight even happens. He's cursed already. There's no dispel for the curse. Unless if it gives the uh, if it gives the orb to a different hero, I wonder if he could attack his own blade master and purchase uh, his own curse away. But uh, this is not gonna happen. He's going for a base race. There's no TP. Maybe he saw there was no TP on any of Happy's heroes. Happy retreats immediately. Let the skeletons do the uh, work and one ghoul. And this base, this blade master is going for this acolyte. Is he, he's going for the main, I guess. Does he have pillage? He does not have pillage. Is he upgrading pillage? He is upgrading pillage here. He only has three raiders, though. He doesn't have the like the typical uh, base race type of army. Kodos, uh, headhunters, they they suck up at base raiding, but the raiders are beautiful. Here comes uh, Happy Nukes the raider. The raider's dead. Do we have TP? 
Wait a second, no TP for focus. So I guess it's not gonna be a base race, it's gonna be a fight. There's a... One statue goes down. Second statue here is going down fast as well. He has one more statue in the back super far. Uh, some raiders dying pretty fast. This fiend is doing... Uh, surviving the, all these misses. Look, Blade Master missing three times in a row. The Kodok is dead. And the Shadow Hunter should be just fine. We have uh, a Blade Master going for this Burrowed Fiend now. Nice stomp hits like three fiends. One of them uh, was burrowed and died. This uh, These guys dying very fast against the skeletons. What did he coil? Not sure. The Burrowed Fiend, I guess. There goes the Berserker. Oh, we have a level 5 Lich now. Info Potion used here on the TC. The Kodo is just fine. This, this uh, Orc units. A nice healing wave. A level 3 healing wave, of course, heals everything. Use uh, Info Potion. I'm not sure if he dodged that coil or if he took the damage, but he, the TC is dead. The Kodo is next, of course, and then the Berserkers. But the healing wave heals them for so much. But it uh, doesn't change the fact that the Kodo dies and the Berserkers will die as well. We have even mana for Fosnova. Uh, Raider. Oh, maybe Berserkers, you know. Maybe they can no, get away. Uh, they walk pretty fast. They can use Berserk to walk even faster if the cooldown. I'm not sure if they use it during the fight. One dies. Or is it just attack speed? It's only attack speed increase. No, I think movement speed as well, right? Oh. Let's see. Focus has 15 supply. That's two heroes, one peon, a berserker, and uh, two more peons chopping wood. Oh, we have a boat over here. Hello. Transport ship. I didn't know there was a boat over here. The Force Nova on the Blade Master. Someone just leveled up. The Dark Ranger. Dark Ranger is level five. Focus. Focus of the Blade Master takes more damage. Shadow Hunter healed up a little bit. Also, I'll uh, bought the Clarity. Is he rebuilding the TC now, right now? He's at 14 supply still. He doesn't have the gold. Doesn't have the gold to rebuild the TC. Could sell some items, maybe, but he's going for base race, of course. That's gonna work. He doesn't have a single Raider. He doesn't. He just has his Blade Master, Shadow Hunter, and, you know. Berserker, but the Berserker is going to die. He's dead. Okay, he's going for... What is he going for? He's going for the Fiend. Oh, Shadow Hunter takes so much damage, man. Right, he's just dead. <laughs> he just dies in a millisecond. GG. Focus in the yellow. Chaco, are you ready? I am ready. I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready for the third game here in the finals. Happy is going for an Altar and a Crypt and a Ziggurat. Again, going for an early uh, Death Knight. I feel like he's been playing death, early Death Knight every game so far, right? That's just how I feel. That's not... I don't remember. I just know he went early Death Knight last game. The first game. What map was the first game? I forgot. I forgot. It's, it's fine, guys. The Acolyte Scout is quite beautiful. We have a lot of snow over here. Maybe it will make a snowman. Meanwhile, over here we have a Blade Master, a Barracks. Shop. Standard build here. For focus. There's a graveyard. More ghouls being built. Death Knight being summoned. Being trained. And before Mass Wyvern. Oh, I think you're too late. It's not gonna be Mass Wyvern. It's not at least Farseer Mass Wyvern. Okay, there's a Blade Master. I want to see some boats. Can you guys please show me some boats? I still haven't seen a single boat on this map. This Grunt here. Blocking the Acolyte. Uh, the Acolyte is dead. 25 XP. Goes to Daisho. Hey, we have Daisho again. He got Daisho last game, but he lost last game. So maybe he wanted a different one. But oh, the Grunt gets ensnared. He cannot kill the uh, Priest. He's killing the Troll now. So these are three different trolls, even uh, though they all look similar. This is an ice troll, and this is an ice troll trapper. An ice troll does less damage, and he has uh, heavy armor. The trapper has more hit points, medium armor, and cast and snare. And he has one armor. Uh, picks up a tome. An ice tome. Meanwhile, the death knight creeping. The same ice trolls at the other side of the map. Anyone in this cage? Maybe you should have checked if uh, maybe someone was in the cage like 
if there's like an orc in the cage, you can uh, help him escape and he will join your side. That's how it works in other games at least. These are fighters. Okay, and that's a healer. Okay, I guess the healer can cast heal. That's what he Please. does cast. And he can cast on himself. What? He does go down here, the death knight. Picks up a mantle of intelligence. He's so smart now. So much IQ. 20 IQ here on the death knight. He's getting all these innocent uh, creepies. All these Tuskars. Tuskars just uh, being invaded. The lands of the Tuskars are being invaded. Maybe in Warcraft 4 or 5. The the next uh, race will be the Tuskars. Because you know they're just living peacefully. And they're being uh, raided. We had, have a class of attack plus 9 here. He killed the polar bear. Got a class of attack plus 9. That's so much damage here. But as we saw last game. Even if it gets a class of attack plus 12. And a hood of cunning. So there's another 4 damage. It's not enough. It's not enough. He needs more. Have a lot of a big Tuscar family here with the babies and the the grandma and you know the uncles. Oh, the blade master will get this. He got, did he get it? Pretty sure he got it. And uh, he got the item as well, ring of regeneration. That was a beautiful there by uh, focus. Getting both the kill and the item. The ring of regeneration not that great of an item, but still it's uh, nice to steal it. This guy has inner fire. Their ma, their grandma died. Now he dies as well. But at least the grandma didn't have to see her grandson die. He rolled a blade master. Is he gonna get some more kills? He's full on items. He wants his polar bear. No, he doesn't. He fiends here. One uh, takes a bit of damage, but he can get. There's coils. There's two more coils. There's one. are micro beautifully aren't they cold aren't fiends cold actually they have uh, some kind of fur right three fiends Captain is uh is he blocking the grunt yes the skeleton blocks the grunt but the grunt will uh, survive the skeleton won't survive though the skeleton goes down the poor little the skeleton three fiends a blade master he's using his big as sword to kill the fiends or to do some damage on the 12 damage is nice. Meanwhile, let me just check his base. He is going for the Shadow Hunter again with the Bestiary. Fiend is still alive. Here we get the Slaughterhouse and uh, Black Citadel. Very fast tech to Black Citadel. Lich is not. There's a Lich. And the Blade Master just killing some Murlocs. After killing the Polar Bear, the Ice Trolls. The Tuskars. Now he's going to kill the Murlocs. He has enemies with everyone. Even the undeads. He doesn't make any friends. Only enemy enemies. If this was Naruto, this would be a completely different game. He would make friends with everyone. Everyone would help him. And instead of instead of being Orc versus Undead, it would be Orc with the Polar Bears and the Tuskars and the Murlocs and the Ice Trolls against Undead. And that's how you actually win this game. That's how you win this matchup. Kappa. Is he going for the troll? He's going for the troll. He used a hex here on this uh, little penguin troll. Uh, not troll. Bear. Polar bear. Damn, a lot of damage. But here comes Happy. But is he? can he do anything here? The Death Knight is still only level 2. And even uh, after he's done killing the bear. Maybe he can kill. Oh, the damn. Nice round with skeletons. But he can save him with the Blade Master. There's a coil on the fiend. But this grunt super low on hit points. We have a, a shield. He could swim, maybe. Uh, there's no coil. The Crunt survives even. So far, this game has gone horrible for Happy. Is this the comeback here for uh, for uh, what's his name? Focus. Shadow Hunter here is uh, is that apparently the bear gives a potion of greater mana. So I'm not sure where he got a class of attack then from. I guess. Oh, nice uh, Fosnova. He picked Fosnova first. Over first armor. So I guess he didn't kill the other polar bear yet. Can you show us the island red uh, creep? No, I can't. Uh, I cannot turn off fog of war. The uh, fiend there is dead. At least this grunt is gonna die uh, in return for it. How many fiends did he lose? Three fiends? For the shadow hunter and one grunt? Maybe he will lose the list as well. He can buy a healing potion. That's what he does. He has the orb now. Does kill the grunt. 
I know there's some dragons over here, like level 10 uh, blue dragons. Daisho is an asshole. No fiends left now. He lost all three of them. He's getting ghoul fancy, he's getting statues. Right, so this clause of deck plus nine, he probably got it from the shop then, because that's the same level item as a ring of regeneration, right? Yeah. So that's what he grabbed there. The polar bear is still alive. The hunter is alive. Wait, did he use that greater mana potion or did he sell it? A player's force. Yes, he also used that. So that's uh, also good for happy. He forced that one to be used. Unless it was sold. Zulkis. Zulkis. 39 supply here for focus, 29 here for happy. I'm just killing some bears. Late Nash devices, info potion. Death Knight finally level 3, finally. Lich doesn't have frost armor, he needs level 2 ASAP. We have uh, the storage being upgraded, although he doesn't have fiends. So I guess the frost armor is not as important. Still, it's uh, great to have it on your heroes, on your statues. I mean, this Blade Master is just doing so much damage. TC is out. Does he buy the orb here? Uh, does Shadow Hunter have the orb? No orb. There's no orb yet here for focus. That means supply is actually uh, pretty much even. Right? 34 against 43. But he still has to buy an orb. Okay, it's still, still a bit of an advantage in supply here for focus. Attack. Under attack. This one takes a lot of damage. He's going for this bear. Let's see what item he gets over here. He gets a uh, wand of mana stealing. Going on the pool. That's Blade Masters here. Blade Master, uh, Death Knight got the XP, but the Blade Mass. What item does it drop? What item does it drop? <laughs> circlet? Was it just a circlet that attack. the Death Knight picked up? I think it was. And uh, the Blade Master did use his Info Potion to get that circlet. And was it a small one? It was a small one. There was the Info Potion he bought earlier. Death Knight just hiding over here while the Lich is creeping. He's level 2. He's uh, pretty close to level 3 already. Meanwhile, the Shadow Hunter is also pretty close to level 3. TC is almost level 2. There's a Coda. Does he have the upgrade yet? No, not yet. Focus is 44 supply. Does he have the Orb yet? Probably the not. Forces are under attack. Getting, uh, Berserker upgrade. No orb, no orb, no orb. Orb of lightning, of course. Dark Ranger is out here. Oh, he's gonna buy a boat. Come on, you need a boat. Look, these guys wanna be killed as well. If you kill their family, look, this is Chieftain. He just kills the Chieftain. Like the grandpa, the grandpa, uh, grandpa just does car. Nice 118 damage critical strike. The DC is level two, by the way. Now Shadow Hunter is level three, and let's see if he gets this uh, circle level item here. Tome of strength and a clause of attack. Yes. So indeed, he got the circle from over here. It wasn't the blade master. He didn't get anything. Where? Oh, look, guys, go the. <laughs> Koda is afraid that oh, he's, he gets seasick, of course. If the Koda goes on the boat, he gets seasick. This boat so nice. He's also level 2. Level 2 mechanical ship. Transport boat. And, wow, well, this is creep camp. Doesn't look that strong. I was uh, expecting worse. Is he going for an expansion on the island? Doesn't have a pocket expansion. I'm not sure where the Blade Master is at. Oh, he's going to put a peon in the boat. A player's force oh, but this bane is under attack. Maybe that's relevant. He doesn't have a TP. He buys a pocket uh, mini expansion. He doesn't have a TP. He's gonna lose some stuff in his main. Oh, spike collar there. TC will pick it up. I assume he will pick it up. Yeah, he picks it up. He will use some healing salves. I assume he will use some healing salves. Place down a mini town hall. Meanwhile, he's losing a lot of burrows and peons here in the main. He will have to go back by boat because he doesn't have a DP. The Kodo, I mean, does fit. Oh, there's another Kodo. Okay. Only one Kodo gets seasick. The other one doesn't. Uh, this Burrow. Burrow is also down. There's one Burrow left. He's peeing on super long hit points. 
Uh, there's a TP out here for Happy. <laughs> there's another peon. Focus at 40 out of 30. He only has uh, two gold peons left, or two peons in general, plus this one, I guess. So three peons. Uh, this one should probably also make a burrow, because even after one burrow, he is still supply stuck. He cannot even build peons to saturate his gold mines. Happy, Happy is going for the boat. Does he realize there is an expansion here? I mean, he does, right? He saw, he saw focus come from the north. Why would he come from the north? Not because he's been creeping this green creep camp. Does this give uh, focus to creep this drag, dragon creep camp though? So focus will get the much better items. He has the spiked collar. Uh, he sold it. Spiked collar. Uh, the fell hunt, the, the mana burn right. guy. Uh, here we have a frost dragon. These are pretty much like frost worms. And uh, you know, except they don't do magic damage, do piercing and chaos. Chaos is better against heroes compared to magic. It's also better against uh, raiders. It's actually against all these units is better than the magic damage, the chaos damage, except the grunt. But uh, the dragon is dead. Happy does have a boat with some gold in it. Uh, he gets a medallion of courage here. Not a great item. Uh, but you know, you give it to your TC or your shadow hunter. It's, uh, you don't sell it. It's not that bad. The grunt, uh, ghouls here, they see this burrow and they're like, ah, oh, burrow, my arch ne nemesis. So do they do a retreat here? Do they go back on the boat with this one? He's being ferried over. Maybe four ghouls is enough against the uh, burrow. Well, let's go for the peons over here. If he kills all these peons. <laughs> Focus is actually not supply stock anymore, but if he kills this burrow over here. I'm not sure if they can get it. There's uh, four, four peons in total over there. This burrow is also going down. He doesn't have a TP. He's Oh, he does have a TP. Okay, but he is a going for the main of happy because he's uh ghouls killing a killing a peon but i don't think they can get a burrow four peons in that burrow happy does have a tp of course slaughterhouse going down he uh will make the trade of course slaughterhouse for a fortress oh maybe he won't get the fortress let's see what else he loses i mean he will get the fortress but he will lose more then he will probably tp there it is it's a fortress. A town is under Lost a ziggurat and a building. Slaughterhouse is 61 supply against 41. Shadowhunter again, uh, not dead yet, actually. <laughs> he has an info potion. He got silence, nuke, he almost died there. Uh, the ghouls, oh, they get stomped. Level two stomp is so great, but ghouls do so much damage against the raiders and the berserkers. Uh, the next stomp could have moved these uh, ghouls maybe to this berserker, but. Uh, I guess it was microing something else. There goes the Berserker. The Raider also super long hit points. The sh Shadowhunter, is he dead? Is there Coil or Nova? No, there's not. Okay, Shadowhunter survives easy peasy. Uh, he does have mana for a Coil now. But, uh, oh, this stomp so nice. You all, by the way, over here, the Ghouls did lose that fight. There's a uh, Dust, the Blade Master is not invisible. He's going for the Destroyer that got uh, ensnared. The destroyer is going to be just fine though, or is he? No, he's dead. That's what I was saying. I was just testing you guys. There, the shadow hunter dies. GG. Focus loses. Happy wins three to zero over. Uh, no, over focus.